It's Hyper Halloween. Okay, hear me out on this one. A slasher film that is reminiscent of B-horror films from the 70s and 80s, completely done with puppets. Well, I hope you're cheering too, viewer, because that's exactly what 2015's Head is all about. Head is brought to us by the minds of Elmwood Productions. Head is actually an hour-long film from Elmwood Productions that has a short film and a talk show segment on the front end of the film to help pad out the runtime. But more on those in a bit. The main feature of the film, Head, is a film where a group of people in their 20s go camping and they uncover an evil that plagues a local town. As I mentioned before, the story revolves around a group of friends that go camping. They meet a stranger who acts, well, strange. The stranger, though, is actually a good guy, but he's searching for clues related to the disappearance of a sibling. The sibling disappeared in the same woods that the friends are camping in. Of course, one of the characters starts to fall for the guy, which makes one of her friends mad because, well, he really likes her as well. Oh, and there are a group of killers that are also stalking the group of friends. Again, it's a standard slasher film that pays homage to slashers of the past, but with puppets. I mentioned that there's a short film at the beginning of this film, a la Disney movies. This is to help people get in the right mindset for what they're actually about to see. The short film is actually a simple zombie film that ends pretty abruptly. The whole film is actually tied together with a segment called Graveyard Gill. It's a horror talk show that features really cringy jokes, and it honestly reminds me of Elvira or the Crypt Keeper segments from their respective shows. It's mostly just the monologue with a weird laugh track. The jokes don't really work for me, and the audio honestly sounds like the person recording it was in an empty room. In fact, a lot of the audio from the film sounds this way. I mean, I don't really have the best setup either, but I feel like they could have done a little more to get rid of the echo. The one thing that Head has going for it though, the puppetry is top notch in every way. The puppets themselves look very good, albeit kind of samey but there's enough detail to differentiate between them. For instance, you know, some have facial hair, there's different wigs, you know, that kind of thing. The Elmwood Productions guys did a great job with the puppets in every scene. And that makes sense though, because Elmwood Productions releases content on a semi-regular basis on their YouTube channel, also called Elmwood Productions. Elmwood Productions has a ton of contents for viewers to watch, including music videos, long-running shows, and the movie Head itself. Head is honestly a pretty solid B-horror film. The puppetry is really cool, and the way that it's shot looks impressive. Obviously, they can't show the puppets driving or holding large objects, but the filmmakers use props and neat camera tricks that really make it work. One thing that I forgot to mention is that Head is considered a horror comedy. I mean, obviously, given that these are puppets we're talking about. But aside from the talk show segments, there is humor sprinkled throughout Head and the short film that precedes it. They're pretty much just dick and sex jokes, but they work for the characters in the story. No worries though, they're not as bad as the ones in Terror at Bloodfart Lake. Now, if you're interested in checking this movie out, then you're probably going to have to seek out a streaming version. I already mentioned Elmwood Productions' YouTube channel, but Head is also available on Tubi if you're interested in viewing it there. Elmwood Productions did do a limited DVD release that contained a few additional short films to watch, but at the time of recording this and when it ultimately releases, I'm not sure if the DVD will still be available. If you take away anything from this review, I hope it's to check out this group of filmmakers, that is, Elmwood Productions. Their content is great and very entertaining, so definitely go subscribe to them. Back to the movie, needless to say, if you want to watch a silly horror film featuring puppets, Give head a watch. <laughs>